morning. So I'm just off to, ah, you thought I was going to say Sainsbury's. I'm not I'm going to Tesco's. Because apparently Cocoa Pops are cheaper in Tesco's. So we're going to see whether you're right, Liam. We'll see. Oh, dear. Bit knackered this morning. Go home, have a shower, get ready for work. Oh dear, not really looking forward to the day at all. Oh, I don't know. Can't believe how fast that year's gone. Major fast. Trouble is, I think when something like that happens to you, well, I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I can remember it like it's yesterday, which is horrible. And I just can't believe it's been like a year tomorrow. And a year since my dad died today, it's crazy. Can't believe that either. But, oh, I don't know. The sun is shining. Just got to, just got to try not to think about it. Think about positive things. So hopefully I can do that. Really, I hope so anyway. Then we're off to get stuck tonight with Rob. So it should be good. Get some stock. Get stuck right up. Still got a bit of a chill, but it is early, isn't it? It's 10 past 8. It's 12 degrees. It should be, I don't know, it's going to be, I don't know, it's going to be a 20, a 20 today, I reckon. Just walking to work. Lovely day. Another lovely day. I think it's going to be a lovely weekend, hopefully. It'd be nice if the weather's like this for Sunday. It means lots of people will be out. Stacey and Isabel are with me. I'll tell you right now, I'm not feeling the best today at all keep thinking that's my trouble now because I've, I've put myself in this position of keep thinking about it because it's a year you know what I mean it's, it don't really oh I don't know it's hard work I'll be glad when today and tomorrow are over you know what I mean I keep thinking about see that was about quarter to two so I keep thinking about quarter to two today it's just stupid, absolutely stupid, but what can I say? I think when you're in that mindset, it's hard to get out of it. It is really hard, but I'm sure we can. That's the plan anyway. So yeah, once I've uh, got today over with, got tomorrow over with, I should start feeling a lot better, but I don't know. <coughs> there you go. There you go. Green cross, green cross code. Oh, I'm gonna run over by taxi. No, it's not a taxi. It's just a Skoda that looks like a taxi. Oh dear. What a lovely day, now. What a lovely day. Blue sky. Down at the creek again, parked the car at Stacey's Nan's house and just walked to work that way. So yeah, look at that. Keep seeing the creek lately, didn't you? Apparently Dave Norris said we're going for a walk tonight. Trouble is, there's no point of even listening to him because <clears throat> where he works, they're just wankers. And he gets... He gets so much shit that he's got to do, he has to stay late. So, he says, yeah, I'll come out for a walk, but then he doesn't end up getting home till like nine o'clock at night. So, <clears throat> but ain't his fault. There you go. So we'll see tonight. Apparently he said, yep, yeah, definitely tonight, definitely tonight. But we will see. Oh, There's a weirdo behind me. Proper weirdo, look at her. So it's just about nearly 
five to four. Um, leaving early today because we're going to go to Chatham and get some stock. I'm going to spend about. I don't even know. I don't even want to know how much I'm going to spend, but a lot. But there you go. So somebody yesterday, I can't remember who it was, wanted to see my bag of scratch cards. There you go. That's my bag of scratch cards. Money bag there. Months and months of scratch cards. I'd hate to think how much money's worth was. So yeah, I'm off to the post office. I've got to go and post a couple of things that I sold on eBay. Ah, <sighs> yeah. Have a little drink before I go. I won't drink too much. Yeah. It's not been a bad day. Touch wood. Working day is over. But it's not been as bad as I thought it was going to be. Stacy stayed for a bit this morning. She stayed till uh, about 11, 10 past 11 or so. So, yeah. Just watched EastEnders. Yeah, so that's good. Still can't quite get over Danny Dyer being in EastEnders. Does my head in. It's the way he is in there. It's just like he's in his films and it's. Yeah, but there you go. So yeah, off to the post office, then off to Chatham, then home. Lovely, lovely day yet again out there. And I'm stuck in here. In the cold yeah, I'm stuck in here. Saturday tomorrow. Got the buses tomorrow. If I can get out, then I will show you the buses. Got the bus buses be here tomorrow and then it's the car show on Sunday so hopefully I'll get back from the boot fair and I can take you down there <clears throat> and we can have a look at that had a little scratch card earlier nice little 40 pound winner there nice but I did buy four of them so it's not too bad um, yeah so not a too bad day so far yes i'm gonna go home i'm having pasta and chicken tonight pasta and chicken tonight ah. gotta get some phones 20 phones sold on ebay all broken spares or repairs there on there just sitting here, I've just done the recording for um, scratch cards on that Saturday because I've been doing them all week, so I've just done that. <clears throat> and I messed up on the last series of scratch card darts because I did it last night. And although it hasn't been out yet, I've not released it yet because I bought a 64 gig card for my Sony Handycam. And uh, yeah, it was a crap one off of eBay. So I sort of messed up there. I thought it'd be all right, but shouldn't have known better for a fiver, really, shouldn't I? So yeah, I lost footage of me actually scratching the cards off, and it was they were winners as well. Not big winners, but they were winners. And um, yeah, it was a bit of a gutter, really, but so I've just had to film more scratch cards, so yeah. So the last series of uh, scratch card darts is going to be up tomorrow, tomorrow night. Yeah, should be good, should be good. Don't know what this is doing, keep poxy things so slow. I put too much on it, that's the trouble. But really it needs to be cleaned, it just needs cleaning, it needs wiping completely. But as soon as I get my Mac Mini, or whatever I'm going to get to run the Thunderbolt, um, this is going to be, I'm going to get it wiped and salted so it's not so crap and then it can just be used for shop business I don't know what it's doing why are you still loading? I'll tell you something though, it's getting hot out here now it's getting hot but I'm going to have to um, 
change the lights back to LEDs or something. I don't really know what I'm going to do yet. Yeah, but it's half seven now. What can I say? What can I say? Half seven, let's do what? What are you doing, you shithead? Oh, poxy thing. Loading, what are you loading? You're not even loading nothing. So yeah, I've just got, well, got back from Chatham about an hour ago. That was all right. Bit of traffic on the way back, which was a bit of a shit, but other than that, it weren't too bad. There's my arrow. Yeah, other than that, it weren't too bad. And then um, just had pasta, cheese, chicken all mixed together, which was nice. Very nice, actually. I made that. Mm. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah. So that was nice. And I think I'm going out for a walk. I know I keep saying it. I went out last night. Took Charlie out last night. Um, about... And nearly nine o'clock, I think it was something like that. While this, while yesterday's vlog was uploading, um, yeah, it was quite good. It was quite good. Just a walk around the block. Well, not really a block. It was about about a twenty-five minute walk. So just to build my steps up. So yesterday I got done all my steps. I'm now halfway through my steps today. So. No matter what, I've got to go out for a walk tonight, somewhere. Yeah, but there you go. Dave Norris actually got home from work tonight, makes a change. Dave Norris has got his legs out. Zoom in on those puppies, look at them muscles they are. So yeah, he's got his legs out tonight. I'm walking down a shop, got my rucksack on. I'm going to... um. I'm going to get uh, take the stuff to the shop what I've got from the warehouse tonight so I don't have to take it there in the morning in the car yeah so then I ain't got to take it there in the morning so that's done now Charlie gets a nice long walk and I get to uh, do my steps so hopefully by the time we get back from this walk all my steps should be up over 10,000 and I've got two days left to go and that's over 10,000 steps every day this week pretty good going a couple of nights I've had to uh oh look it's just been a poo now I've got to go and pick that up <laughs> talking of poo pickers Oh yeah, I was walking home from work the other night, I forgot to say. I watched some old lady let her dog go for a poo on the grass. She see it, didn't even do nothing about it, and just left it there. Fair enough, she was an old lady, but she shouldn't really have a dog if she can't pick it up, should she, really? You know what I mean? I hate it when I get poo on my trainers. Do you hate it, Dave? Yeah. When you get poo on your trainers? Yeah, I do. Dave hates it as well. I'd imagine you all rate it. No one likes getting poo on their trainers. Almost, almost as bad as when you get chewing gum on your trainers. It is, yeah. I must admit, I do spit my chewing gum away, but probably not on the road. In the bushes or something. Yeah. But leaving poo is worse, isn't it? Because then you've got to scrub your trainers and... Anyway, what are we talking about poo? What are we talking about poo, Dave? It's you, isn't it? It's just because Charlie's been... And he's had a poo. Come on. Go on, Charlie. Loves a walk. Yeah. We're not going down Chart Mills tonight. We're not. Well, you want to go over Chart Mills? Okay. We'll go down there. Down this way, isn't it? Can do, yeah. So, I've just been to the shop, and there's a few more boats here tonight. There you go. I reckon they've come in for the weekend. To see the classic car show or vintage car show because they've changed the name to it. But yeah, look, all three of them weren't there, all four of them weren't there the other night, were they? There you go, look at that. Check that out. That's what I want. I want them on them blue BMWs. 
Dave, you want one of them too, didn't you? I could do one, I'm gonna get mine re-sprayed. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So this is all open tonight. Check that out, I think it's Italian. Italian, um, yeah, I'm sure it's Italian because the chef from that place there comes in and sees me. And that's what it's called. Pasilipo? Yeah, I think it was, I'm sure it's Italian. But look at that, I didn't know they had all like heaters in the garden and all that fun stuff around there. It's well not. So this is the last time that you're going to see the old Dave's BMW 3 Series. You right, Beth? It's going tomorrow night. He's going to pick up the camper van from my brother and then they're going on holiday for a bit. So yep, yeah, that's all off. And then uh, he's getting his new car in the back. When are you getting it next week? Two weeks. Two weeks time. Here have his new 3 Series. You get her uh, 12 plate 3 Series, I think. Very nice, gold. Hmm, does look nice. But yeah, he's showing in the old 3 Series there. I did think about having it myself, but Stacy wants a 5 Series or a Tora, one of those. But there you go. Okay, right. I'm going to end tonight's vlog here. Hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. If you have, then give it a thumbs up and subscribe button's down there if you're not subscribed already. And yeah, tomorrow we are in the town. Hopefully I'll show you some of the buses and what else are we doing tomorrow? Barbecue at Rich's house. So yeah, there you go. Right, oh yeah, before I go, I just thought I'd do a shout out for my number one fan. Um, say hello to my sister Kirsty. Yeah, my sister Kirsty, she lives in Ramsgate so yeah say hello to her podcast yeah so she's um she watches my vlogs every day she loves them and hello to Gary and all the kids as well all nine of them she loves a the kid right I'm going see you tomorrow <laughs>